Hi guys, I'm Choi Ling, and today we are going to cover the latest talk of the town, Nomentum Park, with attractive prices starting from 16xx per square feet. In this video, we will share why everyone is talking about it, whether it is a good investment, and what are the possible issues or concerns some may have. So let's go! Momentum Park was a HUDC built in 1977 by our former Deputy Prime Minister and Minister of Defence, Mr Go King Sui, with the purpose of providing affordable housing for SAF commissioned officers. It was then later privatised in 1993. This plot of land was later on block and sold to Kingsford developer for 830.1 million or 969 PPR per square feet later in 2017. Momentum Park is located at District 5 in the Bona Vista 1 North area. The land size is 63593.7 square meters and the tenor of the land is 99 years commencing from 22nd July 2019. Just imagine the size of 9 football fields. How big is that? The development consists of 9 24 storey blocks which provides 1862 residential units of which 1840 are 1 to 5 bedroom units, 22 terrace houses and 8 commercial units catered for shop spaces and even a restaurant. It is estimated to complete in the second quarter of 2023. Indicative price for 1 bedroom ranges from 7xxk, 2 bedroom from 1.0xx million and so on with reference to the chart. Having said that, these are only indicative prices pending confirmation. Early birds, of course, will be able to enjoy discounts during the soft launch and booking day. The preview period is starting from 2nd Gen to 13th Gen 2021. So how else would you want to start your new year than to purchase your new future home? Prices will likely slowly increase according to demand and the market trends after the preview period. Due to COVID-19, viewing the show flat is only strictly by appointments and appointment slots are on a first-come, first-served basis. So to avoid disappointments, Contact us via this QR code to book an appointment now and have the freedom of choice to choose your preferred unit. Before we dive deeper into the site plan and the development, let us talk about one important factor, be it for investment or for own stay, the location. Living near nature with Kent Ridge Park located just a stone's throw away is a major selling point. But what doubles up as a bonus is having a site gate that leads you directly to it providing direct connectivity to Teluk Langa Hill Park and Labrador Nature Reserve via Hot Park and the Southern Ridges. So if you are someone who loves greenery and nature, this is the one for you. If you're not a fan of nature, this would also be a development to look out for. And why? Nomentum Park is strategically located relatively near the MRT stations, where you get a constant flow of tenants if you decide to buy for investment. Usually for investors, you'd be most concerned about the tenant pools. But fret not, Momentum Park is located near NUH, NUS, Science Park 1 and 2, 1 North and Maple Tree Business City etc. Furthermore, this place is so-called the Science Hub or you can say the Silicon Valley of Singapore. So you will see many established companies or tech firms like Apple, Dyson, Canon, Shopee and even Grab HQ. So you'll definitely be spoiled for choices. In terms of connectivity, Enjoy a nice stroll of 11 to 15 minutes to Kent Ridge MRT or take a shuttle bus service provided to Kent Ridge and Bona Vista MRT. If you wish to have more control over your time, there are many bus services like 97, 197 and 963 which brings you to Kent Ridge MRT within 5 minutes depending on traffic conditions. For drivers, there is direct access to CTE from AYE which takes approximately 10 minutes to the CBD area depending on traffic conditions. Alternatively, there is also an upcoming underground tunnel that cuts across Kenridge Park located just outside the development which brings drivers to West Coast Highway via South Buena Vista Road. This development provides a 360-degree unblocked view. And what do we mean by that? If you look at the site plan, all the blocks are built at the edge of the land with the facilities in the middle of the development. This only means one thing, that the blocks are spaced out especially if you love pool view units but still value your privacy. Not to mention, the site coverage is about 20%, meaning 80% of the land has been used for landscaping. Most of the projects are about 35 to 45%, so having 80% of the landscaping and facilities is definitely a plus point. If you prefer unblocked views, 
There are also ample options for you to choose from, be it greenery or sea view. But you may wonder, how is that possible with the AYE Expressway? This is because Nomentum Park is situated on an elevated ground, about 6 meters elevation from AYE. All the buildings are also designed in a way in which the second floor is way higher from the site ground itself, almost comparable to 11th floor of a typical development. So, having a huge area of space also means that the ventilation can flow within the development. The facings of the blocks have been carefully thought through whereby most homeowners would enjoy north-south facing, which is highly sought after. Also, as it is surrounded by greenery, hills and water elements, there is literally feng and shui in the development, which many will look out for. Next, be it for investment or for own stay, another very important factor most people would like to know is potential capital appreciation. Will there be potential capital appreciation? The answer is yes. But how and why? Many new developments and plans are in the pipeline for the area. Let us just talk about perhaps the most anticipated one, the Greater Southern Waterfront. Touching on some key details right here, the GSW is about 2,000 hectares of land, which is almost six times of Marina Bay or two Pongos. City terminals like Keppel, Tanjung Paga and Brani and Pasir Panjang terminals will be shifted to Tuas in the future, freeing up prime lands to reshape the GSW for users of leaf, work and play. For instance, Keppel Club will slowly be redeveloped into 9,000 housing units and more office spaces will be added near Labrador Park. Decommissioned Pasir Panjang Power Station will be redeveloped for recreation purposes. Pulau Brani and Sentosa will be revitalised and GSW will also be linked with green areas. For instance, from West Coast Park to East Coast Park and from Rail Corridor all the way down to Sentosa. So if you look at the master plan around Nomentum Park, you can see many empty plots of lands that are in the blue and beige zones. Blue zones means commercial and residential, while beige means residential. This only means one thing. These lands will be transformed into future developments of offices, shopping malls and housing, which are the contributing factors that will further appreciate your property value. So why Nomentum Park and not other surrounding developments? Right now, there aren't many comparable condos in the Bona Vista 1 North area. Surrounding residential developments are mostly smaller apartments which only consist of 10 to 80 units and majority of them are at least 20 years and above. The few bigger developments are like One North Residences, Heritage View, The Rochester, One Rochester, Dover Park View and the upcoming Cambridge Hill Residences. However, if we narrow down to age and accessibility to Cambridge Park, only Cambridge Hill Residences takes the mark for a direct comparison. Tenants always look out for new units to rent, and buyers are always looking for new projects to buy. So with lesser competition, renting or selling in the future will be much easier. Unfortunately, Cambridge Hill Residences is selling fast and choices are limited. However, if you are still keen to find out more on Cambridge Hill Residences and what is still available, you can also drop us a text and we can share more with you. So those who have missed out on your preferred units for Cambridge Hill Residences previously, you can take this chance to choose your ideal units with this new launch. So what are you waiting for? I'm sure many of you know that the launch of Nomentum Park was delayed when the controller of housing issued a no-sale license to the developer as the company has failed to meet the requirements for a sale license. A development usually needs to achieve a quality mark by the BCA of at least 80% in order to achieve TOP. What is BCA Quality Mark? It is a scheme launched in 2002 to encourage developers to deliver quality homes with good workmanship and BCA will inspect every newly completed unit to give a rating of at least 80% out of 100. So in Nomentum Park's case, in order to achieve TOP, the developer now has to ensure that every single unit meets the 100% quality mark. So is it a good or a bad thing? Without a doubt, a good thing. As for buyers, you'll be guaranteed quality finishing for your unit. In a nutshell, there is a lot more that we can share on the upcoming development, which we are so excited for. For example, the floor plans, the ideal facing, the most affordable stack, premium stack, whether you should go for investment or own stay, etc. Which a short video like this is not enough to showcase. So, is Nomentum Park a good buy? Based on analysis and facts which we have shared earlier in this video, we definitely think it is. However, we also do understand that everyone has their different priorities and views. So why not give us a call or drop us a text to find out more on Nomentum Park 
be it floor plans, updated pricing, or any latest updates for us to discuss and analyse with you if the Normanton Park is the right fit for you. Lastly, remember to subscribe to our channel and click the like button for more updates on the upcoming videos. See you soon! Bye! Call our AAG Real Estate Consultant to find out more. AAG, the number one top division in Orange Tea and Thai.